Like many rural places in Uganda, Mubende district is no stranger to belief in witchcraft. In Madudu sub-county, people thought their family members had been presented as human sacrifices by their relative who had recently bought a truck. The first people to die were from one family. In that family, there was someone who had bought a 10-wheeler tipper truck. They suspected he had sacrificed them. But the family members were not from one house. First, it was an old woman aged over 100 years. Then, it was her grandchild who got married a distance from her grandmother's home. They were all dying in hospital, but the cause of death was not clear. When we approached the LC one chairperson at, in that place where five people died, for him he thought that it was witchcraft. So they started going to witch doctors and all that. But after one week, they realized that it, it, it wasn't even uh, witchcraft. It's when they came in and started reporting to the health centers. Stephen Dajishimana, a district councillor representing Madudu sub-county, informed the resident district commissioner, the security head. When I got overwhelmed, I wrote to the RDC. Consequently, health people intervened. There is a young man who died and he was taken to Kampala for testing and that's when they discovered that there is Ebola in Madudu. On 20th September 2022, the Ministry of Health confirmed Ebola in Mubende but by this time it had spread to neighboring districts. The leaders cannot roll out if those affected were running away from witchcraft. The case that went to Kassanda was from Madudu. They ran there thinking it was witchcraft. The case that went to Chegegwa was from Madudu. The case that went to Kagadi was from Madudu. What can we do to save the situation? Health Minister Dr. Jane Rutha Cheng urged Ugandans to seek medical attention if they experience Ebola-like symptoms. Tell the people not to run anyway. Even if they run and they are running with Ebola, they will still die. As of 1st October, the Ministry of Health had confirmed 38 Ebola cases and 8 deaths from the disease.